Oh, hey, it's time to talk about sandbags. Hi, this is JP Morgan. Today on Slime Lens, we're going to talk about sandbags. Not a sexy topic, but one that everybody uses on set. These don't weigh 250 pounds. Did you fall for that? Really? So, but what we have here is one, two, three, four different types of sandbags. Number one is this is a handle bag. Oh, this guy is probably 40 pounds. The weights vary depending on the manufacturer. Ours are about 35 and 25. I think this is more like 40. I don't love this handle because the handle goes over the top. And so when you put it on a leg, it doesn't pull the sandbag off the leg when you pick it up. This one, the handle goes across the sides of the sandbag. So when you put it onto the stand, and it's locked onto the stand, you've got it right here, and it lifts itself off from the stand leg. Much easier to use. These, when you put them on a stand, when you pick them up, the weight just gets tighter, and it's hard to get them off from the stand leg. So, there's a different kind of handles. My favorite, obviously, pulls across the side. So across the front, across the side, different weights. We have 35, or probably 45, 35, and 20, or 20, yeah, probably 20. This is the one we use the most because it's just a nice weight. It's easy to move around, easy to put on stands, it's easy to use. These are all sandbags. This is a shot bag. It's filled with lead shot. So it weighs as much as this, but it's in a very small, compact little container. So shot bags, you can get them to use them on booms, on the back of your pole. They're just really small. You don't have to deal with all this huge bulk to be able to get a nice amount of weight on the back of a, a, a boom. So shot bags are really worthwhile. So I would look at those, get a 10 or a five pound shot bag, just great to kind of give you some weight. These are great to lay down if you're gonna put your camera on something. Once you get your tripod set up and really set, it's got that little hook right in the middle. You ever wonder what that does? Well, you just put a sandbag on there. And now your tripod is weighted. It's not gonna fall over. It's not gonna get bumped very easily. If someone kind of knocks into it, it's not gonna fly away. And here's the sandbag that I always take when I travel. I take this uh, Rocksteady bag by Photoflex. It's a bag that has zipper pockets in it so that you can put water bottles or something and you can take it on location. When you get there, you buy some water bottles, fill it up, and you got a great sandbag to go on your uh, lights or your tripod or whatever you're doing. Let's now talk about the proper way to use a sandbag on a stand. First off, a lot of people do this, which just doesn't work. If you throw this on here like this, and somehow you think that's going to hold your, your stand, as the stand pulls up, this will fall off, slide off, and the stand falls over. So it doesn't really work. So we put the sandbag in here, can't fall off, it's gonna give us nice weight. We can lift up on this handle right here and it pulls it away from the stand and then slips out really easily. So that works out very nice. Now, the proper way to use it, on a C stand. I see people all the time that drop it on that leg right there. What happens is that most of the weight is on the ground and not on the stand. So the stand's gotta lift up quite a ways before it starts to engage the sandbag. So you really have to use these things on a heavy leg Get it off the ground so all that weight is solid on the stand. I also adamantly feel like they should be away from the weight. If you've got a heavy light and it's pointed that direction, more of the weight's that way, put it away from the weight. It pulls harder. It's going to hold the stand up. So there you have it, sandbags and the proper way to use them on a stand. So keep those cameras rolling. Keep on clicking. Don't forget to subscribe to the Slanted Lens. We're hanging out here. We're waiting for you to subscribe. Quick, subscribe. I can't do this all day. You've got to subscribe. Quick.